What's up, what's up, lovely people? How you doing? It's your boy Hima. Uh, first of all, I shaved my beard so I look like a little baby. Um, you know, not the rapper, you know, like a little baby. Uh, so today I'm going to be doing something really exciting. I'm still at home and I'm headed towards the city. I'm going to be buying physical gold. Yeah, not jewelry like this. Physical gold. Uh, I've traded gold before and I made some good money from it, but I've never owned physical gold so today i'm gonna be buying physical gold and of course if you're in melbourne or in australia you got few options to try out uh today i'm going to the australian bullion company you got melbourne mint perth mint so many companies to choose from but i'm going to the australian bullion company um and i'm give i'm gonna be buying half an ounce not a not an ounce half an ounce like that's like thousand two hundred something dollars um and that's well aware in my budget so i'm gonna do that and i'll see you guys at the city this is gonna be really 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 exciting all right guys so i just bought my first uh, half an ounce of gold um it's it's tiny bit like as you can see i'm not gonna take it out of the bag um got it from abc they're the ones who are selling it um, this tiny piece is almost thousand two hundred dollars. This is half an ounce. Um, the market price right now for an ounce is two thousand dollars. So this is the half an ounce, and um, I got it. And I'm kind of happy. And I'm. This is the thing. If you buy gold or silver, never keep it with yourself. Always put it in a safety box. So I already have a safety box, and in safety boxes, guys. Uh, you know, if you want to open up a safety box for anything, you're gonna have to either there are so many options. Uh, so many people are offering safety boxes. Of course, the big four banks offer safety boxes as well, and, and there are private companies, and all of these uh, go from 200 to 300 dollars per annum. All right, so it all depends on you. If you wanna put it in a safety box, I think that's the best way to go, uh, because never keep gold or silver at your crib um so yeah so that's the thing i'm gonna put this in a safety box as soon as possible i'm gonna have to go home and go through the charts with you um of course i was kind of expecting a bit bigger um, amount to be honest but again this is half an ounce what you get for um and the reason why i bought the cast bar instead of the mint bar is because this is industrial gold so with industrial gold you have the ability to uh, sell it anywhere you want and mint gold is basically local so if you i don't think you'll be able to sell mint gold uh, overseas so you know if you're planning on traveling this is a safe way to uh try, you know get uh, get money overseas of course it's small and this is worth about thousand two hundred dollars the reason why I bought gold is it's forming in a technical perspective a cup and handle formation. Um, we are still under the 200 moving day average line, uh, and I think this is a really good chance for you to start buying into gold. Of course, um, this is half an ounce. Um, I currently don't have enough money to spend to buy a, half, a full ounce or even more, and my next purchase is going to be one kilogram of silver because silver is obviously cheaper than gold all right guys so i'll let meet you at home i'm gonna go now and put this in a safety deposit box i'm not gonna tell you which exactly so you all can't rob me um so and uh, we'll go home and we'll look into the charts and i'll explain my reasons behind my gold purchase all right guys so um in the morning i bought gold now i'm gonna show you why i bought gold and uh, why you should consider maybe buying gold and of course i told you uh, where i bought it how i bought it and what i did with it please do not keep physical gold at yourself with yourself always put that in a safety deposit box um so that's exactly what i did and of course you got four major banks offering safety deposit boxes um and of course there are private companies and all of these products, all of these uh, services vary from 200 to 300 dollars per annum. So it's up to you to decide where you want to put your stuff. Is like I, you should also have my uh, Jordan shoes uh, in these safety boxes. Um, so that's why where I put my gold. Okay, so let's get into charts, and I'll show you why I uh, think that gold is preparing for a bull run and why I bought gold. 
So we are looking at the charts, right? Um, the first and foremost, the main thing that I want to show you guys is this big cup and handle formation. So um, hold on, I'll draw it to you so you guys can see what I'm talking about. This, that's a cup and a handle. And we know a cup and a handle is a bullish formation. So that's the number one reason why I'm buying, uh, why I bought into gold because I think we are ready for the next super cycle. Um, I think um, hyperinflation is coming and it's on the horizon. So I think gold will do, not just gold, silver, and all the precious metals will do really well during the inflation. And of course, I'll be buying silver as well. I'll make sure to do a video, but this is on gold. Okay, so, and the other thing is like, um, of course, I think the the price mark that will trigger uh, the buying options would be the 1,800 mark, and we are only like 20-ish dollars below that, actually. Um, so I think, and then the next move will be something like, um, you know, coming over here and then taking up, and of course this level over here um i think we'll be breaking that um if we if we did pass the two thousand dollar mark i think we we are obviously officially in a bull market but i think this is a uh, possible move towards the future and of course it could come down but i don't think it will bottom out this one thousand six hundred dollar mark but if, even if gold comes down you should buy into gold um, and the other thing is, like I told you, hyperinflation. We know governments are printing shit ton of money, trillions and trillions of dollars throughout the entire world. We know what happened to Venezuela, Colombia, Brazil. So I think this will happen. It's already happening. Inflation is already there. We just don't see it. Um, so I think it's best to be prepared, uh, you know, against something like that. So that's why I bought gold. And of course, you don't have to go all in maybe put a little bit of an amount and buy a, uh, like an ounce or i don't know two ounces however pleases you of course a certain percentage of your portfolio should go into gold and silver i think it's best um so that's about it and of course this is a short video and if you guys have any questions please put that in the comment section i hope this was helpful um this is actually again there are types of gold that you, you could buy I had I did a different video about gold like which type you should buy they have ETFs gold miners and of course you can buy physical gold um, so check that video out um, and thank you so much for watching and if you enjoyed this video please hit the subscribe button and I'll see you guys in the next coming videos peace